Martin is out of that car safely. Here it is again from our high view, Garvey and Cranifus. Steve, it looked like Cranifus might have turned down a little on Mike Garvey there. Garvey was inside and there, Philip into the wall and starts barrel rolling and gets hit while he's upside down. It was Mark Dismore that piled in. Robbie Pyle, no, Tim Taylor's machine, Scott Hansen, Mike Miller, all involved there. Gilchrist also involved in the four. Let's take another look. The one inside the 27 and the 27 goes around and Garvey apparently stayed on the gas and rode up over Phillips nose. And there was the 27 starting that barrel roll down the racetrack and when you see that at a place like this you can see there's where Ricky Johnson got involved. He was the first car on the scene locked up and Robbie Pyle bunted the 27 and tipped it upside down there in the middle of the back chute. Scott Wimmer involved. Many contenders heavily involved. Here it is again from Garvey's onboard look. And Cranifus looked like he came down low. We were riding with Mike Garvey there, and it just looked, hate to point fingers here, but it just did look as though it was Cranifus turning down. There you saw it from Ken Alexander's machine. He was on the scene as Cranifus was barrel rolling down the backstretch, and Steve.